you know, you're not as suave as the boss said you'd be. And you believed him? You'd be surprised how many in the business know of your work, Mr. Kumo. Guess they were just rumors, though. Well, maybe I'm just out of practice. Nowadays, I'm only good with the women. <laughs> Liam. Neil. So, what's going on? The boss said he gave you all the details. Said something about wanting us to kill two guys for him. For what? Said something about them making fun of his kid. The daughter with the huge eyes. Yep. What an asshole, man. Hey, one time he had me kill a guy for looking over. I'd say these two are way more justified than that. He must love this kid a lot. Who wouldn't? She's an adorable looking fella. What do these guys even do? Probably the same thing as everybody else. Make fun of her for her huge eyes. I like her eyes, though. Right? Bunch of dickheads. It ain't even that. What kinds of gangsters go around making fun of a six-year-old's eyes? <laughs> yeah. Gangsters. <laughs> so then, where do we find these guys? Well... Man, fuck. You've got to be kidding me. They live here? Hey, don't look at me. They're the ones who made fun of the daughter. So that's what the fake IDs were for, huh? Mate, if that thing give it away, I don't know what will. <laughs> All right, that's my bad. Anyhow, how the hell are we gonna kill two college students without them tracing it back to us? No worries, my bug Carl's got it covered. Right, Carl? Got it, brother. Who the fuck? See, nothing to worry about. Boss told you? All this? I don't need the boss's permission, man. <sighs> For fuck's sake, man. Okay, then. But what are we gonna do about the other students in the dorm? Aren't they gonna hear us? Well... Carl made up some stuff about a party in the quad or something. Now hurry up, open the door. Loosen up. I gotta kill someone. I'm gonna loosen you up. What did you just say? I ain't say nothing, man. No, say it again. made them piss their pants. I think they actually did. <laughs> Shit. You. Mm -hmm. Your name's Walter? Yes, Walter Legan, sir. <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you, man? All you have to do is not. <laughs> you. You Jonathan? Jonathan, Walter, now those are some hella black names. <laughs> I know what you mean, man. Shit. <clears throat> Fellas, out the door. My good friend Liam will lead you the way. And I suggest y'all don't get on his bad side.
Sit down, boy, sit down. No need to be scared. Okay, let's start. I'm Neil, he's Liam. Good. Now that we know each other, let's get into the gist of things. Actually, one thing. My guy, Walter, who goes through Instagram and almost through a laptop. And again, Johnny. Okay, okay, that's, that's enough, man. Hey guys. Nice shoes y'all got on. What? KD's? Jordan's? <laughs> you know, y'all can talk now, right? I'm the one leading the conversation, not him. It's no use. I scared the shit out of him. Right, boys? I could go to a whole other country and they'd still be scared shitless. Damn right. <laughs> <laughs> Laugh. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Alright, you done now? Sure, sure, by all means. Do your stuff. See this girl? <laughs> You guys happen to know who this is? Can either of you give me something other than? Now that's unfortunate. Because apparently, you two insulted our boss's daughter. L listen, it, it wasn't us, we swear. Right. 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 That's too bad, motherfucker. Because our boss wants you two specifically dead for making fun of her big, precious, luminous, most adorable looking eyes. What? What do you mean, dead? Oh, it's. It's rather simple, really. It's just something like this. Oh my god. Do you get it now, brother? Huh? Do you still need me to help you understand the concept of death? I can shove your head up his ass. Oh my god. For you to physically see his internal organs shut down. No, please don't. You don't think I will? I did it to a brother from France. Say I won't! Uh, okay, okay, I believe you. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> I know you are not gonna cry. <laughs> Give him a break, Liam. He must be stressed out after seeing his friend get murked around the front of him. Hey. You okay? Good, because we wasn't done with you yet. Listen, Walter. I knew a kid like you back in the day. Young, stupid, and butt-ass ugly. Now, whatever god or high being there is up there, what he did to you, that's messed up. But still, we cannot forgive the ultimate disrespect you gave to our precious pretty young thing. Did you just make a Michael Jackson reference? <laughs> <laughs> Shit, he stole his brain. So, you're saying all of this was because we made fun of your boss's daughter? Yes, that's exactly what we're doing. W well, look, man, I'm really sorry, but we didn't mean it that way. What did you just say? What? I didn't say anything, dude! Oh, yes, you did. You just did. Right now! No, no, no! I, I was just asking for context! No, 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 no! You admitted it. Right now. We even have it on recording. Hey! Carl! Oh, it is over for you. What the hell? Were you in there 
this whole time? Just shut up and listen, fool. Why does everyone have guns? Did you not just hear what this man said? He said to shut, shut your up. ass up! Was it because we might find your boss's daughter? Yes, that's exactly what we're doing. Well, well look, man, I'm really sorry, but we didn't mean it that way. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm sorry, Walter, but your time has come. Here, think about it this way. You know, when I was young, my father and mother would tell me that I was born for a reason. Obviously, they didn't tell me what that reason was. It's just something every parent should say to their kid. It's parenting 101. Mm -hmm. But here's the thing, though. As I got older, I eventually found said reason. My purpose in this world is to get rid of those I deem as filth. <laughs> Those who degrade humanity to such a miserable state! And you, Walter, you are that filth. No, please don't! Walter, I judge thee as guilty <gasps> for not only insulting the boss's most precious daughter, but for being one of the most beta males I've seen in my life! No, please don't! <laughs> ah! Good job, Neil. I'm impressed. You too. <laughs> so what are we gonna do about the bodies? Hey! Carl! Yeah, brother? Still got the spare gun? Oh, you know it. And the alcohol? Ah, right here. Suicide. Interesting. They won't suspect a thing. I bet. I can see why the boss recommended you for the job. It may be college students. That don't make the job easy. Maybe easier. But still not easy. Yeah. You're right. Damn. The alcohol looks good too. <laughs> 